Generic greetings and welcome back once again to Supermarket Simulator. Today's beverage is a highly carbonated lemon and lime soda. So welcome back to the game. In the previous episode, we managed to do some expansion and get a new employee who is not impressed to work here. They, however, are stocking our shelves. So we've got the storage space here, and the idea is that we'll take products from here and then put them in here. Now, that does serve as a bit of an issue because... In reality, we want to have shelves for every single item in both the shop and in here and basically do restocking from the storage. Is that going to happen? Well, the plan for this episode is to go ahead and get another section, section two, and that will... Oh, we'll also be able to get section three. Maybe we just go for massive expansion next door. Or... We can get another product line, which will go here, which could be, like, for cleaning items and such. Um, haven't yet decided, but what I'll do is go ahead and see what we need to buy. So we need spaghetti, we need oil, we need salt and uh, cheese, I think. Yeah. So it is over to the uh, market here. It was uh, cheese, just the one for now. Uh, actually, we'll pick up two. Why not? So it was cheese. It was um, salt. It was oil. And I think, what else do we want? Um, I think we'll get some milk because we're running low on that one. Don't know about the cake mix or anything else. Uh, well, it's just a cake in general. Uh, spaghetti. And we'll purchase those. It would be nice if the, uh, the stock bot would actually... Um, pick up and move these things but uh, apparently not let me just place that on that shelf there and this one I will I'll just do it like that and there we go that's now done uh, displays full I'm just gonna dump it in that corner and uh, we'll go ahead and put the cheese in so apparently you can press and hold oh yeah there we go that's actually a lot easier than um, mashing the button and what else do we want to place this is the thing like I can place the stuff there and place that there but we've removed an item which is a bit of a shame um do we have i was gonna say do we have salt but we can't have salt because otherwise they would have uh, already refilled it automatically which um yes uh we'll throw that over there that got sent at a ridiculous pace and then the oil will go in i actually think we'll end up emptying this box yes indeed and what we're gonna do is get this one open so Another day, another another dollar, as they say. I think we can pick up some of that uh, beverage there. Let me just go down. I've adjusted some prices as well. Uh, let me just pick up a couple of those. Don't particularly want to spend too much money. Obviously, we still need to keep refilling. Um, is that... Is that cake mix or just cake? I think one of these is just cake in general. Um, oh, looks like the first customer is picking up some rice and some oil. A bit of home baking, perhaps. And, yeah, peanut butter, I think. And, oh, look at that. So, Stockbot is coming along and dropping off all of this. Excellent. And Tillbot is working well too. A couple more customers. Previously they were getting stuck. Um, a reload has seemingly fixed it. Oh, that's really good. That's gonna. It's still gonna require us to do some manual restocking, but I think if we spend our time on stock control, that's the way forward. Um, and we will ideally not ever have to look at these shelves for restocking. What we'll be doing is basically having all of the storage racks and have one of every item on those racks. And as those racks deplete, we then come, you know, fill that up. That's the idea anyway. That is the overall long-term goal. Looks like some of these have been sold. So we'll put those on the shelf. And we can get rid of that. What else have we got? Salt. Nobody's buying salt. Uh, looks like rice is going down. Some of the marshmallows. 
Uh, chocolate we can probably restock. So it's going to be right near the bottom because it's relatively new. We'll get two of those. Then we'll pick up a candy as well. And I'm sure this cake, yeah, this cake here is going down. Now, obviously, the oh, eggs are going down as well. Um, the fellow doing all of the stock replenishment can only do a certain amount at, at one time. But all of the stock on the shelf is essentially our buffer, isn't it? It doesn't really matter how long it takes him to do it, as long as we don't run out of it in the long term. I do think we need another cashier. Um, I think a latest update actually allows you to turn off uh, cashier points. I've not done it, so I don't know. In fact, we've not done any uh, any cashier work since we hired this person. Is this actually live? Oh, that's a bit of a shame. So I thought this would be live. Oh, it is live! Soda. Two. It do, yeah, it is! I was going to say, that's uh, pretty good. Sorry, this, this employee is almost certainly thinking, am I... My boss literally looking over my shoulder to see what I'm doing. Yes, I, I apologise. I don't want to be doing any micromanagement there. Um, the checkouts are full. Yes, they are. So, may need another checkout. But the main thing is expansion of next door. That's what we will be doing. Coffee's gone down a little bit. Tea's going down even more. And the marshmallows are all right. Everything else is not terrible. Yogurt's uh, getting sold as well. Mr. Bond. And, uh, yeah, bagging up those groceries. We still have the tractor cars that are coming past. <laughs> Hang on, this is going to be the best one, isn't it? <laughs> uh, utterly ridiculous, and I hope they don't change it. Um, right. <laughs> They're still saying the checkouts are full. Yes, indeed. Uh, we're up to 653.93 generic units of currency. I'm going to see about bills. Bills are all paid. Uh, growth, section four, is a four by four expansion. Almost certainly it'll go that side. Um, but we don't want to do that. We want to increase storage, which is 800 generic units of currency. No customization options just yet. Hiring, we can get another cashier at level 20. We're currently level 15. Stockbot 2.0 uh, is at level 22, but we need at least double the amount of racks that we currently have, but we will get that. Um, yeah. Also, licenses. I do want to get this, like, essentially this cleaning license. We could actually get that now. Um, you've got things like cheese and tuna and honey, butter cereal and chicken, um, pizza, um, so that'll require a freezer. But having like the shampoo and hand soap, that'll be make this more of a complete solution for people's shopping needs. I think that is accurate. Is that uh, ready to go in the bin? Yes, it is. And there they go. Oh, looks like we've got the money to go to storage and purchase. And obviously, we'll then need to go back to the market. Furnitures. And I want at least... Oh, okay. I'd like at least um, three more racks, but that isn't going to happen, is it? And... Oh, there we go. So we could easily get racks across here and a few racks across here. Now, I'm going to pick this up. I'm going to hope that, yes, it does stick. All the stuff there. And so I reckon two more racks in there, then a couple of racks in here. Um, another light, perhaps, <laughs> is in order. And also, computer. People did suggest this in previous episodes' comments. Move the computer in here, because then we can simply go, right, what have we not got, and go from there. That's the plan. And... It's going to take a bit of setting up, but I think the time and effort will be worth it in the long run. We're in it for the long game here. See, this is why we don't need to extend the store, because there's, a, you know, there's loads of room here. There is loads of room. Um, what we don't have loads of is money. And I'm going to get a spotlight. You know what I'm going to do for now? I'm going to get rid of uh, that rack. Oh, I can't. Well, I can, actually, but it doesn't matter because it's... 
it's after nine anyway, so... Hmm. Just waiting for the rest of it to go through. So we'll have to do a, a bit of a stock, a bit of a restock tomorrow. Um, in the morning. Yogurt is too expensive, is it? Fair enough. Stock bot's working well. Um, where's that? Oh, did I use this? No, I was going to say, I didn't use all the salt. So there we go. There's that done. And you're doing great work. Appreciate it. And, yeah, I think what we'll, we'll redo it from the left. We'll just work from the left and go around. Although I know that's not going to happen anyway because eventually we'll have freezers along here, so that'll become the new left. But, you know what? As long as all of the items are somewhere, we'll be all right. I was about to say, it's going to be a bit of a mess on to rearrange things, but not really. We can move these shelves down as well. But that's the game. That is that is <laughs> that is the game. Um... Star is now level 16, which is good to see. And we got 369.98 generic units of currency. We are down on several items. But I'm just going to wait for these guys to finish. And once they've been served, we'll go to the next day. And in the morning, the, uh, the employees can... Well, employee can keep restocking while we do... Basically some purchasing of of more shelves. I think it's going to take another couple of in-game days. Yeah, another couple of in-game days, I think, to, uh, to get things sorted. And I don't think we're going to double stack. Like, the, uh, sorry, we are going to double stack, but I'm not going to do, like, this, like, double flower. There's no point in double flower. All I need to know is how many boxes are on these shelves. And we get, I think you get two on each one. Or these might be able to go up to four. I haven't yet found out but i do want to find out um obviously these big boxes can't but the idea is as soon as we see a box missing here we know that the shelf is being restocked in here anyway enough waffle next day so rice candy and flour has gone up so rice um candy and Forty-nine and fleur. Mm, we're still under what we need. Okay, so purchasing of items. We can't get. Oh, we can. We can get that. Let's purchase that and get this set up. So let's put that there and. Put the light in. Yep. <laughs> Just going to go in the middle. And okay. So what I want to do is rearrange these shelves so they follow this layout. So, yogurt, milk, eggs. I'm going to forget if I do it that way. Yogurt and milk, eggs and cheese. So yogurt and milk. I guess technically we could stock it almost entirely like we have the previous one. Um, yeah, I don't think so. Why is that not got a, well, it has got it's up there, isn't it? Um, let's just get rid of some of the, I'm just going to move things over for now. Obviously, this is a bit of a testing thing. So, the milk is actually at the top, isn't it? Something like that. And I think the yogurt's there as well, but it's going to be a bit different. So then we want, um... The next one's going to be sodas and such. Yeah, I've got that there. Eggs is going to be um, just below the milk. So there we go. Eggs. And... Eggs. Oh, I think actually they're going for a restock. Yes, they are. Ideally, we want cheese. Don't we? And then Water. But I can't afford those things, I don't think. Um, cheese. And water. Yes, we can. Only just. So I am going to pick those up simply to go like this. And like soda. Uh, soda can go in. It's going to go around here somewhere. 
water can go there. Just move things, ar things around. Uh, the soda, I don't know if it's going to go there. Oh, Stockbots picked that up. Uh, cheese would be there. And cake mix, or cake, and, and that, and all of this. This can just go somewhere else. Okay. So this is set correctly, I believe. We've still got some space here, I am aware. So we might do some stock overflow there. But the next one is orange. Yeah, orange, apple. So it should be orange, apple, uh, this soda, and... Ah, see, that's going to be a bit different, isn't it? Because this is this is a five stack. So cola and the other and the other stuff, but I don't think we have that. Or if we do, it's in a state of flux currently. Yeah, so we're gonna have to put that there, and then we'll we'll, we'll move over. What we're gonna do actually is I'm gonna open the shop and actually do some selling because that's sort of what we have to do. So I want cola and the other soda. Let's pick that up. Um, from this list. So we've got, um, let's see, uh, that's soda, and you know, I'll pick up two of those, and it was the other one that I can't find. There's two of those. So 51, and then a four generic currency delivery fee. So I'll wait until we've got that amount of money, and then I literally pick that up, and then I know that that shelf is done. Thumbs up, we're all good. It's going to take. A couple of in-game days to go through and set this up but once it's set up i think that's gonna really help our productivity until i have to start moving things around and it gets confusing and i lose the will to live um <laughs> anyway so definitely need more spaghetti but i'm i'm mm, I'm, I'm tempted to I'm tempted to do some restocking here oh looks like we didn't need all that chocolate um, this mix, though, we'll put in. There we go. I'm just going to put that in this, in here. And... Well, that's stored. Excellent. So we just need this other two sodas picking up. And as I said, there will be some gaps. But I'm, I'm happy with that, because then I can just get overflow. And inevitably, inevitably what will happen is... I'll end up having to um, move things around anyway, and it'll get confusing. But that's that's is what it is, isn't it? You know. So this is the caller, and that is yeah, it is on the bottom one. So it goes there, and it goes there, and then this caller, even though it's on the bottom shelf. Actually, to be fair, we can do that, can't we? Why is he just staring at the cheese? Are they? Have they? Oh, yeah, I think they got stuck again. That's going to become a bit of an issue. If, if they keep doing that, that is going to become an issue. So the next one is chocolate, um, candy, and bread. So it's going to be on this one. So chocolate's already in there. Perfect. Let's see if this can be stacked up to four. I think it can be. Oh, it can probably be stacked even more. Um, that can go over there. Chocolate, candy. Let's go ahead, go down, and get some candy. Um, two candies and two bread. Actually, no. Let's get four boxes of bread. And purchase that. So the bread is well. It's chocolate, candy, and bread. Ah. Um, that's cheese. Yes. Right. So there's bread. And I think we'll double stack the bread. Ah, oh, but the bread shouldn't be there. It should be on here, shouldn't it? Yes, candy should be here. So move that along. As I said, this is going to be in a state of flux all game. Let's just accept that this is going to happen and move on. Candy. Uh -huh. Move this along. Don't know what that's going to be yet. 
at least there's some attempt being made <laughs> at um at keeping things in a decent order so chocolate candy and bread that's now done oh right um pasta spaghetti flour and uh rice so it was pasta i think we have some actually pasta spaghetti actually that's uh rice and what was the last one pasta Oh, we've got nothing on the bottom shelf, that's why. So yeah, pasta, spaghetti and rice. Fine. We can do that. Um, purchase. So that's that confectionery one. I am going to need a lot more. Shelf space. I think we're going to have to double up, aren't we? Put the, put the bread there. And I can put it on this one. So spaghetti is second one down. And I think they're stuck again. And rice is on there. Let me just double check if that is the case. Yes. So that can go there. And then top shelf was the pasta. You can do that. There's going to be a lot of unhappy customers. What they're trying to pick up. Definitely stuck. Which is not good. And also it's dark. <laughs> We're running out of loads of stock. <laughs> oh, it's all going to hell. Um, right, stock bot. What's up? Let me just pick that up. And it can, oh god, yeah, they're trying to they're trying to grab whatever is there. Look, what is it? Look, is it that? It is not. Is it that? No. Is it this? Potentially. <laughs> right, I think so. But they've got on with other things. Oh, look how bare the shelves are. <laughs> right. At least the refilling. So, both flowers and then cake is the next one. So, uh, flour. I think we might have some in stock, but I'm just going to buy anywhere. Uh, flour, cake, and cake. And we can purchase that. So it was, from here, flour, flour, and again flour, and another one, uh, cake, Oh, is it the right order? No, all the other way around. Um, technically that and that. And they're stuck again. Yeah, this isn't going to work. If they get stuck all the time, this isn't going to work. Hmm. That's disappointing. If we spend all our time setting this up for them to simply not function... <clears throat> Hmm. Running lawn sisu sugar. And other things as well. I'm gonna uh I don't know what to do. Is it because these are too close together? Do we need a bit more of a gap? Nope. Apparently it doesn't matter. Okay. Well, that is worrying. Is it because the items are at the top shelf? Or no, because they were struggling to pick up some of this. Hmm, I mean, early access and all of that, but this is a fundamental part of the game that if it doesn't work, well, we might as well stop. Okay. Well, <clears throat> excuse me. Let's... 
continue on. Um, we do. I was going to say we did have flour. So I need for this queue to finish, and then we're going to get the next one, which is salt, sugar, and then the oils. So do we have any of that in here? Oh, we have cake mix. Which, or, or cake, anyway. Um, we have all of the flour. Could double up on it, but leave it for now. Got some tea. Lots of cereal. So it was um, salt. Four salt. Two oil. Two of both oils, actually. And what was on the bottom? Uh, sugar, of course. Sisu sugar. Which is here. 197. We're up to 803.91. Oh, and this customer's bugged out as well now. Nope, looks like they're okay now. Ah, oh, I'm guessing they're just wandering around because of the checkout. That's what it'll be. <laughs> yes, definitely another checkout would be helpful. But if we can't rely on Stockbot, who is currently malfunctioning, can we reset Stockbot? <laughs> I don't know what it is they're trying to pick up. It's not that. It looks like it was the cheese... Yeah. But they're cracking on with other things now. Hmm. Well, we'll keep an eye on that. I mean, we're still levelling up, which is good. I know there's a lot of redundancies in these shelves, I am aware. But it's starting to look pretty good. The way everything's all lined up. But obviously, stock-wise, we definitely want to get all of these, we want the shelves full, completely full, and then we can just say, yeah, we're, we're fine. We can let the uh, let the guys crack on and do their thing. Only three more customers, and then uh, we should be good. So, is this going to be rice? No, it's pasta. And that's an empty box. I'm guessing some of these shelves will uh, show as empty. See, that shouldn't be that. See that one there? We have eight. So, long, at least the tags stay. If they didn't, then this would just be a nightmare. <laughs> It'd be like, nope, not doing it, refuse. Good grief. You, I mean, this is going to be a big sale. I'm going to go with 120 generic units of currency. What are we up to here, actually? Yeah, was it, I wasn't cheating. That was obscured by the card reader. Uh, 110. Bring her up. And there we go. Next day. So, product's not found one. But that's alright. Uh, Zap Soda has gone up. Three... 49. So... Let's get ordering. We want to get all of this, and we want to get it on the shelves. But stock butter's broke. Again. Yep. Let's get rid of that. Right, well, we'll do what we can. We'll do what we can. Right, purchase. And salt was on the top. And I picked up four drums of salt because I knew that it was quite a small box. So, let's get all these moving. Oh, looks like we'll, you put... I think basically, salt, because of the size of the box, you can probably just... <laughs> um, you can probably just buy it once, and then leave it. Like, just fully stock the shelves. I think that's probably the way. Um, let's get all this done. And actually, it's surprising just how quick we've done this. It's been pretty much set up. Uh, one more box. Uh, sorry, one more 
a bit of furniture. Cool. I'm going to get two small racks and I'll purchase those. I, I'm going to guesstimate they're just not going to fit in. It's going to be like just... Oh, I think we can fit that in. I just need to... Um... Hmm. I need a bit of space. Uh, so that and that. And yes, lovely. Lovely, lovely. So we've been on working on this. So it's tea, milk, and, and milk, I think. Yeah. Tea, milk, milk, and then we do we just milk across all there? Lots of milk. All the milk. Tea and milk. So, oh, we have tea, actually. We don't have milk. I'll get um, another couple of teas and this milk here loads of it and purchase that so it is tea no there please and more tea mm, peanut butters later on hey <laughs> it stays up and then the milk tea and milk which I'm just gonna Get a good stock of. Can we double stack these? We cannot. Stock bot, bot is currently working okay. But for how long? For how long? And... One more milk. There we go. And then we need another shelf, which is going to go in here. Uh, just fling all of these in that corner. Otherwise known as the middle of the room, not a corner. Uh, <laughs> get this opened. And uh, jump. Jump, jump, jump. And that goes in there. So we need... Uh, it was coffee. Was it coffee? So yes, we want coffee, peanut butter, and both cereals. So to be fair, we have a lot of that. And it is that one. And that one. And... Uh, that one again, uh, flour can go there, double stack that, oh, another flour. Um, this is where we go, actually, should we put it somewhere else? Yeah, then you start messing some of it up. Uh, so it was peanut butter, peanut butter, so we just need some coffee, really. I'm going to go with, uh, I'm just going to go up the top, no, it's not there. Uh, we're going to order even more spaghetti, because I'm noticing that's uh, getting... Uh, pretty much empty and we want still have got the actual coffee which is what I was aiming for we'll get off of four coffees and purchase that while I'm here as well just realize that we should probably go and pay our bills couple of outstandings there and we have three <laughs> generic units of currency all right so anyway um yes yeah, so you can see that the spaghetti is empty um we've completely ran out of uh ran out of spaghetti so we have this overflow here, and when I could put the rice down there and then put the spaghetti there. It's still in the same order, so that's not too concerning. The bio juice and the coffee. And you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to open the shop. Because, you know, that's sort of what we have to do uh, to make money. And another coffee. I assume we don't have to open the boxes, right? I think when you put on the, the boxes close anywhere. Yeah, they do, so that's fine. What about this flower? Uh, can't really place that there. What could be an issue is if stock bots going back and forward and if, say, they pick up a box here and then re-refill it, they then can't put that box down. So I have to be wary of that. So yes, we shall see. Uh, milk is just flying off the shelves. What they're picking up now? That uh, that one there. Fair enough. So what do I need to fill? Um, I'm seeing a lack of. We need water. We need cheese, and we need eggs. So let's make a, a list. So it was uh, water, cheese, 
and eggs. Yes, that's fine. Keep working well. And certainly some of this cake mix. Ah, oh, but hang, no, wait, we have that. We have that here. They just haven't got round to refilling it. And I don't know what order they are <laughs> attempting it. But yeah, I think more rice as a staple. Let's see about rice. I'll add that in. 215 generic units of currency in order to get this. Did I even turn the lights on yesterday? I can't remember. <laughs> People just shopping in the dark. All right. The salt's there. Hmm. I think it may be the case that... Oh, we're out of cereal as well. Wow. I think it may be the case that even if Stockbot is working perfectly well, we probably can't totally rely on them for this size of store. We're going to have to do things ourselves. I totally maxed this out anyway. But that's okay. Um, let's go ahead and help them out. So we want some... It is salt. Get that filled. Job done. We can see candy there. Do we have candy on the shelves? We should do. It should be here. There it is. It's exactly where we thought it would be. Again, I don't know why the... I start with a couple of gaps here and then I've decided just to stock it like that. But uh, it works fine. Flour. That should go there. Yeah, it's tempting just to dump it there. But then if I get into that habit, that's a bad habit to get into. Bottled water. Cheese, eggs, rice and cereal. Uh, total price. 309 generic units of currency. Which we are approaching. Lots of stuff getting sold now. Star level 16. If we had another checkout, I would be able to sit on said checkout and help out. Hmm. Anyway. Oh, they're stuck again. What is it this time? Is it the milk? It wasn't the milk. Is it the, the... Yeah, it's the cheese. They couldn't pick up the cheese. Maybe they're lactose intolerant or something. I don't know. Um, let's just stock this up. So there's the cheese. Uh, the water. There's some road cheese. <laughs> Which sounds worse than what reality is. And, oh, water. I've, I've really over-ordered on water. Not the rice, though. The rice can go in there. Mm-hmm. And eggs. Uh, oh, we were actually out of eggs completely. Right. The rice goes in. As do the eggs. And... We need... What was it? Both cereals? think so. One and where's the other? Yep. Yeah. What else are we low on? Mm. Apple juice. We could probably get another apple juice. Just the one, I think. Uh, apple juice. Orange juice is fine. Water's fine. We could probably get more... Oh, we need more candy. Excuse me. Let's purchase that while it's uh, still possible. We'll put light on. So, candy. And this is where the stock control comes in, where we can see what's missing. So far, there's not been any big dramas with Stockbot today. We've managed to fix any issues. Oh, we've got, we have that, we have lots of that cereal, apparently. Hmm, 
I've definitely over-ordered on that one. It was the other cereal that we needed. No matter. No matter. And peanut butter. Definitely. Peanut butter, two of. And we've got a little bit of time just to finish off. I think we're going to get some oil and sisu sugar. So the sugar and the oil and the oil and only just afford that just in time. So the oil will double stack peanut butter, more peanut butter and the sisu sugar. Uh, sorry, it was on that one. And that one. That's all good. And the oil. Yeah, so we are just, we are back office staff members now. <laughs> yeah. And there we go. So, that's all set up. Definitely. These cakes. Uh, is that just a case we, they haven't stocked it yet? Yep, we've got 36 and 37, so that's fine. I'll uh, give them a hand, shall I? Don't worry, everyone. Stock is in stock. There we go. Um, what about this flower? Flower, flower, flower. Sell it ourselves. I'll put it on the shelf ourselves. Hmm. We're out of the other flower as well. Let's go ahead and place uh, some of this cake mix, I think. Or is it, yeah, this is a cake mix. And there's that. Pretty much sorted. Anyway, I think we're going to leave it there for now. That's been a bit of Supermarket Simulator. Store level 17 and we're up to 332.21 generic units of currency. Just this last bit of sale to finish with. I don't know if you end the day now, it calculates all the people, so I am just going to wait. Um, but pretty happy with the stock control now. We can get another one of these racks in. And I think that's what we're going to do next episode. Uh, next episode, we'll spend the first half basically going through all of this stock and buying anything that I think we really need to uh, have in stock. You know, fill up these shelves, have a nice backlog, as it were. And like things like that flower, we definitely need to get, um, I would say, three of those. Because one's going to immediately fill the shelves. And then the two little others will sit there. Um, yeah. So we'll see how we get on with that, restocking-wise. And then we're going to unlock another product line, which I think is going to be the cleaning products, which I'm going to probably put here. Alternatively, I could probably get another cashier and sit here. But I'm not yet sure. I think... I mean, the customers happily wait. It doesn't seem to be a problem unless that's affecting store level. But we'll see how we get on. As always, hope you have enjoyed the episode and as always, comments in the comments. Thanks very much for watching. Take care and generic partings.